Hello Capricorn, I hope you're all doing well. Welcome to reading. So, please keep in mind that this is your reading and it will not resonate forever. Okay, for Capricorn, please bear a message for Capricorn's love situation for Capricorn. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck we have the ace of pentacles someone here wants to offer you a pentacle something solid something long term someone who sees long term with you someone sees forever with you this is forever so let's see for the present situation we have the three of pentacles so someone wants to work things out with you someone wants to fix the situation someone wants to find a resolution here some might want to rebel this connection as well, okay? Start new, start better. Why is the Three of Pentacles here? The Knight of Cups. Someone has a lot of love for you here. Someone wants to give you everything. Love, commitment. So, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. So, this, you know, connection here means a lot to this person, right? They see this connection as very meaningful to them. And they want to do everything, right, to get back with you. Why is the Knight of Cups here? Why is the Knight of Cups here? And that Queen of Swords, Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. Could be you, could be a person. I'm getting this as you. I think there's someone here who wants to offer you love. But you could be closed off here. You could be guarded, you could be hurt and have some resentment. This may be definitely someone that you already know that you could have cut off. Maybe ghosted, rate, right? cut communication, cut contact. Someone here wants to be on good terms with you. Maybe you cut this person off because they were not giving you what you wanted, right? Because you were giving all of this, you know, love, stability to this person, but you were not getting the same in return. Now it's like, it's all about partnership now they want to get together with you right and give you what they did not give you in the past they want to meet you halfway there's going to be equal give and take here now yeah you may not see this coming there's someone here right it's you're turning your back to this person either you know you're rejecting their offer or you're not seeing this coming here so roles could be reversed okay so let's see for the blocker potential the nine of wands oh it feels like you're gonna be guarded yes that you're guarded you have your walls up they want this so badly with you now you could be hurt and tired yeah i feel like you could be hurt and tired you already gave to this person right you wanted for this person to get it the first time and now you're like in a different energy right with this person now you you're closed off they feel that it's going to be a challenge here to get to work things out with you yeah you have your back turns they feel like it's going to be a challenge here why is the nine of wands why is the nine of wands the lovers someone's so in love with you here right under the knight of cups someone's so in love with you and passion as well and stability everything this person woke up to this connection here so it could be with a gemini so deep soul connection here they're very drawn to you with that lover's car they still feel like they can't you know forget about you you're still on their minds they still feel that bond they could still feel your energy you could also feel their energy as well why is the lovers here? Why is the lovers here? The high priestess. So two things here. Someone's intuition is screaming at them that you're the one, right? But it could also be that there's silence, right? You're giving this person the silent treatment. You're not seeing anything, okay? Either both of you are not seeing anything or you're not seeing anything. But someone here wants to break the silence. Also, someone who has 
a lot of emotions for you, right? That was the block. Someone had a lot of emotions, but it took them a while to express them to you. Now they're coming towards you. Maybe, you know, you never expected for this person to come towards you with a love offer because for quite some time, they were not telling you anything, right? They were not telling you how they felt. You could have felt your person didn't feel anything about you. But there's definitely a love offer here coming towards you. Let's see for the recent past. For the recent past. In the five of wands, conflicts. Yeah, you may not be on good terms, right? Conflicts, inner conflict. It could also be competition here as well. Arguments, there's like tension between you two. Why is the five of wands? Five of wands here. In the chariot. Yeah, I mean, I think, you know, it could be there with the cancer, but you thought, right, that both of you were on this chariot going in the same direction. But this person, there could have been influence and interference here. This person could have gotten off that chariot and chose another path, another direction. This person was not ready for commitment with you so they got off the chariot you know for so many reasons this person could have gotten off that chariot here so you thought you know it would lead to long term you could have offered this it to your person in the past right you were offering long-term stability but they were not ready they were not ready to to go in your direction in the same direction as you okay there was just interference, there were conflicts, there could have been competition. Why is the chariot here? Why is the chariot here? The six of wands. Yeah, I think you wanted victory here. You wanted victory within this connection. But I'm getting your person could have wanted victory with 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 what was going on with this five of wands. Other with the interference here. Not saying they didn't want victory with you. Maybe this person wanted it all, right? They want a victory with you, with everyone, you know, but they had to choose a path here. Because they're all over the place. A lot of confusion here. And so, yeah, whatever was going on is five of wands. Your person could have been very influenced. And they wanted victory. They wanted attention from others. They liked the attention, right, that they got from others here. But I think that, you know, this person realized that they made a mistake here. I think if they chose someone else here over you, another path, I'm getting a lot of regret here. Let's see for the focus. For the focus. The four of cups. Yeah, a lot of regret here. Sound feels like they missed an opportunity with you. Definitely here. They feel like you're the one that got away. See? They're, you were giving, right, this cup of love here. They were not interested. They were not looking at it. They had other people. I'm getting this person had other options, other choices. Why is the four of cups here? Why is the four of cups here? The eight of swords. That was very closed off. Now, yeah. So what's going on is that they want to give you a cup of love, right? This person could have rejected you in the past. Now their focus is they want to come towards you with this cup of love. But see how nervous they are? They're very nervous here to approach you. Because they fear you will reject them. They fear rejecting big time here. This is how it's, you know, it's in the reading. See how they're coming towards you with that love offer? But you're like... Someone's nervous here, very nervous. There's a lot of guilt and shame for what they did, and now they fear that you will reject their offer of love, that you will do the same, right, that they did to you. Someone's overthinking things. That's why they kept quiet for, for a long time. I think this person needed a lot of courage to open up to you, okay? I don't think they're there yet. I think they'll come towards you, but when they'll release these fears, okay? Because right now I think that they're keeping quiet here. They're not telling you how they truly feel. Yeah, maybe they fear that you also have other people that are interested in you. They fear 
you know, competition here. So that was definitely like creating a lot of scenarios, like what can go wrong, right? But they know they messed up. So they know that you're you're looking the other way. You're you're not, you know, you could be angry here. You could have some resentment. Why is the eight of swords? And that's seven of pentacles, yeah. That's why they see like that, that they missed an opportunity. They realize they missed an opportunity because they see an opportunity with you. Seven of Pentacles right above your card. You're the one that got away here. And now they can't stop thinking about you. Okay. Let's see for the near future. For the near future. That three of wands. They're waiting for that moment. Right. When they'll come towards you with this love offer. It's a matter of time here. Because definitely a person wants to come towards you. They're, I feel that they're very drawn to you here. I feel interesting because I feel a lot of fire here. So why is the three of wands? Why is the three of wands here? The six of swords. Yeah, someone wants to make peace. They, they don't want for you being this queen of swords energy. They, they don't. Someone's afraid of your words, your reaction, that you'll lash out at them. That's why there's fears. They fear your judgment. I think that, yeah, they fear your judgment here as well. Because they don't want for you to view them the same way, you know, as before. Whatever, the, you know, whatever judgment you have, okay, about this person, they don't want that. They want to make commands here. They want to move towards calmer waters with you. Could involve traveling. They definitely want to approach. I don't even see communication. Like, they want to come and see you. Why is the Six of Swords? Why is the Six of Swords here? And the King of Swords, a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. See how cold and distance? Eight of Swords, King of Swords, the High Priestess. They're not telling you anything. They're not revealing their emotions. They're so scared of your reaction here. They're being very careful with you here. Very cautious. Let's see. For the what you should know. The Knight of Wands. Yeah, that's the thing, right? They don't want for you to view them as a player here. They want for you to, to view them as mature. King of Swords. Even though clo you're very close, closed off in this. You're both now very closed off, I'm getting. With the High Priestess, you're not revealing their emotions. But your person wants to end that. Your person wants to annotate the initiative towards you and, and offer you love. But they fear your judgment. They fear that you'll view them as a player here. But yeah, they want, that's what I wanted to say with the King of Swords. King of Swords is, is still very serious and mature, right? Even though they're cold in distance, I think you're, they want for you to view them as more mature right if you take the energy of the king of swords not in terms of emotions but in terms of maturity they want for you to take them seriously yeah like a king of swords with integrity because they want to come towards you with integrity to take them seriously yeah that's what they want that they don't want for you to view them as a as a player they're very serious about you. Ace of Pentacles. They want for you to trust them. Trust their offer. Why is the Knight of Wands here? The Five of Swords. Yeah, it's like a lot of conflicts here right now. It's. I, I think they understand, right? That they sabotage something good. They sabotage something good. I think they know that they're... They know themselves that they're a player here. They know they have self-sabotaging behavior. They were very mature. This person knows that they were very mature here. But someone wants to win you back here. Where's the Five of Swords? The Three of Swords. A lot of pain here. So, maybe also with that Eight of Swords, right? 
they're nervous because they know they caused you pain. They could be in pain, but they caused you. They know that their their behavior caused you pain, right? They put you in a third party. So there was a third party here, possibly, right? Very in and out. See, this person was in and out of your chariot here. I'm seeing this chariot, you know, as your chariot. And this person very in and out, right? Going in, coming out, whenever they wanted, whenever they, you know, they please. And so that's why they're, they're, they're ashamed here to approach you. They know they messed up. Let's see for the outcome. The Nine of Pentacles. Well, they offer you to take them serious. I think this person is going to do what it takes for you to take them seriously. So Virgo here. So there's a waiting period. Yeah, there's a waiting period as well because, I mean, you see this is... They want to transition from someone who's actually... I mean, if they want for you to take them serious, well, they need to be serious, right? They need to be stable. I think your person, there's a way to, because your person's transitioning from a Knight of Wands to a Nine of Pentacles here. Someone who's serious, someone who's stable, someone who's single as well, right? Someone who doesn't come with baggage. Someone who doesn't come with options, access, right? Uh, this person wants to do everything here to make sure that you'll accept this offer. Your person's very serious about you here. That's what I'm getting. There's a lot of guilt. I'm getting a lot of guilt. They're very drawn to you that I'm getting here. And so they don't want to mess it up here. Why is the Nine of Pentacles here? And the Six of Pentacles. They want equal give and take. They want to see you, right? But they want equal give and take. They want for you to accept what it is that they're going to give to you. They want reciprocity. They don't want rejection here. I don't think this person will take it very well if you reject them. Yeah, they want, your person wants for you to take them seriously here. Why is the Six of Pentacles? Why is the, why is the Six of Pentacles here? Why is the Six of Pentacles? The Ten of Wands. This person. Whoa. Someone here. As so tired and exhausted here from being at a distance from you. Someone's in a lot of pain without you. They just want to see you here. They're at the end here. You know, after the Ten of Wands, it's the Ace of Wands. They want a very badly. I'm telling you, they have, there's a lot of fire here. They're very drawn to you. And that's the Ace of Wands, right? Even though it doesn't show it in the reading, after the Ten of Wands, it's the Ace of Wands. They're very drawn to you. They have, still have a lot of desire here. This person is feeling at a loss without you. They're working really hard. They want to work really hard. That's what I'm getting here. They want to work really hard to get your attention here. If they wanted attention from others in the past, they only want your attention now. You and only you. So let me just get another card. Why is the Ten of Wands here? The Four of Wands. Oh, yeah. Someone here wants your attention. Someone here wants commitment with you. Even marriage here. They're tired of being at a distance. They still love you. They're tired to pretend that they don't love you with that King of Swords. They see long term potential with you so it's up to you right if you see long-term potential with this person so that's it capricorn so i hope it resonated with you i hope you enjoyed the reading take care bye